Hello human, thank you for being on the channel. I want you to click the subscribe button to join the Terrence family. You know, back when WandaVision came out, there was a lot of theories and articles about the show. And you still have some articles and things floating around on the internet about the show. Humans discussing what's going to happen to Scarlet Witch in relation to the upcoming Doctor Strange movie, which is going to dive into the multiverse. So that should be pretty sick. But apparently, Doctor Strange was going to appear in the WandaVision finale, but then they decided to cut him out of it because he's a white man. And I'm like, is that true? Because if it is, that is a stupid-ass reason. Because, you know, in this day and age, white man bad, agenda SJWs and stuff like that. You got the media out there trying to paint a certain narrative, which is dumb as fuck. You know what I'm saying? That's why I don't really care what the media says, I like to think for myself, let the humans be on some bullshit if that's what they want to do. But um, I thought he was going to make an appearance in WandaVision because the setup for him to make the appearance was there, you know, just the whole introducing the Darkhold and stuff like that. And uh, the Darkhold was created by Kathan, you know, so in the comics, Kathan beat the fuck out of Scarlet Witch and Quicksilver and it was Doctor Strange that had to help Scarlet Witch defeat Kathan. So I thought we were going to get like maybe a Kathan and Agatha Harkness kind of team up to go up against uh, Doctor Strange and Scarlet Witch. And then ultimately Doctor Strange would put these motherfuckers in a place. But you know the finale for WandaVision, it was cool and stuff. I mean they didn't do jack shit with White Vision. That was a goddamn waste. And I feel like the best part of that finale was Wanda getting her actual uh, comic book costume, which made my dick hard as fuck when I saw that shit. I feel like that's the best part of that finale. Wanda finally has her fucking costume. But uh, other than that, though, I feel like, you know, you had a lot of theories out there, didn't pan out. There was a lot of setup, though, right? Like, if you just, like, fuck all the theories for a moment, right? If you just look up the, the look at the setup that they had, it was there, right? You know, the stuff with Quicksilver, they didn't do shit with that. That was also a waste. Uh, the stuff for White Vision, they didn't do shit with that. Uh, the stuff for uh, AIM, they didn't really do shit with that. The stuff with Kathan, Mephisto, they didn't do shit with that. Nightmare, none of that shit. So there just was a lot of setup that was there. And you would think they would have a more direct tie-in to an MCU movie. Since you're using characters from the MCU movies, it would have made sense for Doctor Strange to be there. I just hope, you know, they decided, you know, Kevin Feige was like, you know what? We gonna wait to use my boy Doctor Strange. I hope it wasn't, well, we would have used him, but he's a white man. And we didn't want him to take away all the credit from Wanda. I'm like, look. Those that were fucking with WandaVision before Doctor Strange, they still would have been fucking with that show. You know, Doctor Strange is a big presence, but it just would have been cool to see Scarlet Witch and Doctor Strange team up. You know, Scarlet Witch getting her ass whooped and stuff. Because a lot of these normies, they don't know how powerful Scarlet Witch is. You know what I'm saying? They think they know because they saw her lift Thanos up in the air and Avengers Infinity War and all that shit. I'm like, look, the strongest this character has ever been is in the House of M storyline, but that's not like a guideline for how Scarlet Witch is 99% of the time. She's pretty powerful, but she ain't that damn powerful. She ain't even gonna think about laying hands on Doctor Strange. You know what I'm saying? The Sorcerer Supreme, so you can miss me with all that silliness, but she is cool and she is powerful, so shout out to Scarlet Witch, but man, I feel like they did Doctor Strange dirty, but look, it's not all doom and gloom because... We're getting Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. You know what I'm saying? I feel like Doctor Strange is going to be epic there. I like the character. He's he's different from a lot of the characters associated with Marvel. And I really dig him. I think Benedict Cumberbatch did a great job bringing him to life. So we'll see what happens. You know, I guess you never really know. But there's all sorts of articles and theories out there. But... I mean, if this is the reason, like, they didn't want to use him because, you know, he's the white man and the white man is not supposed to come in there and save the female in distress kind of shit. If that is the reason, that is dumb as fuck. But they had a chance to bring my boy in. They didn't do it. So now we're going to wait and see his movie to get us two hours of Doctor Strange. Thank you for being here, human. I want you to like this video, share it with your family, your friends, whatever humans you may know. 
you punch the shit out of the subscribe button to join the Terrence family. Yo, they got to stop doing all this agenda stuff. You know, that's why we have these, you know, making these videos and different things. Because, I mean, even when you got the stuff that's not confirmed, it's just like, even when you hear about it, you're like, that shit might be true. Because they on some bullshit in Hollywood anyway. Terrence out.